Hey guys, welcome back. Today I'll be telling you the first things to do in hard mode in Terraria. Before we begin, don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't already. It's free and it helps me out. Let's get straight into it. Hard mode can be daunting for a Terraria, especially with all the new and powerful bosses and enemies. So I'll be giving you some things to do as soon as you enter hard mode that will make your life so much easier. No, that's a lot of damage! So the first thing you will need to do is get the new ores in your world. You can do this by smashing altars in the Crimson or Corruption. As you can see, there's an altar right above me. And you can use the hammer you get from the Wall of Flesh or any other upgraded hammer to destroy them. And you can get six new ores. You will need the Molten Pickaxe to get the first ores, which are Cobalt or Palladium. Then their respective pickaxes for the next ones, which are Mithril or Oracalcum. And their pickaxes for Adamantite or Titanium. Then make armor out of the adamantite or titanium bars that you have. You will need 55 adamantite bars or 59 titanium bars for the full set of armor. After you destroy the demon altars, the ores will be scattered all over your world. A really easy way to find all of these ores is to go down to hell because it's a giant open space and just look up at the ceiling of it and you'll find lots of the ores. As you can see in the video, I've found tons of it just by doing it for like two, three minutes. So if you want to get the ores fast, that's a great way to do so. To smelt the ores, you will need a Hellforge, for the first two at least. For the third one, you will need the Hellforge and 30 of either Adamantite or Titanium and combine them to make an either Adamantite or Titanium Forge. Then you can melt the third one and also use either Mithril or Aurochalcum to make an anvil. Once you reach hard mode, most of your good weapons are now garbage. That means you will need some new ones. Some of the best early hard mode weapons are Amarok and Beam Sword for melee. Amarok has a 1 in 300 chance of dropping from any snow biome enemy and Beam Sword has a 1 in 150 chance of dropping from armored skeletons. Onyx Blaster or any of the hard mode or repeaters for ranges. The Onyx Blaster is made from a shotgun sold by the arms dealer, two dark shards from dark mummies in the desert and 10 souls of night. And the repeaters are made with up to 13 of the hard mode or bars. Crystal Serpent, Frost Staff, and Golden Shower for magic users. The Crystal Serpent has a 1 in 200 chance of being fished up in the Hallowed Biome. Frost Staff has a 1 in 50 chance from Icy Mermen and Ice Elementals. And Golden Shower is made with a spell term from the Wizard, 15 Souls of Night, and 20 Icor which can be obtained from the Crimson Biome made at a bookshelf. And finally, the Spider Staffs, the Spider Staff and Queen Spider Staff for summoners, which are made up from 16 and 24 Spider Fangs respectively. Wings are vital for mobility, whether it's dodging attacks or trying to get up to a high place. Wings are what you need. Plus, they negate fall damage. Some good wings you can get as soon as you enter hard mode are the leaf wings. You can get them by buying them from the witch doctor at night in the jungle for one platinum. It may sound expensive, but they are definitely worth the money. Now with all of this stuff, you are ready for hard mode. Now you can defeat the enemies with ease and they do less damage to you as well. If you enjoyed this video or found it helpful, 
please like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell to get notified when I make a new video. Thanks for watching, and see you all next time.